Hi and happy holidays. I'm Erin of Juniper and Oaks. I'm a crochet pattern designer and I love running crochet alongs with my crochet community. I am so excited to bring you the Cozy Alpine Stocking Cow. And uh, if you want to know what it is, we are making this stocking together. This is a brand new stocking pattern that is previously unreleased. Actually, the people who bought the um, Cozy Christmas Corner Bundle when they did the Berry Bobble Christmas Cow, um, they got this pattern included. But um, other than that, this has not been publicized anywhere, and so I'm really, really excited that we can crochet this along together this weekend. So this is a four-day crochet along, and how it's going to work on day one, we're going to crochet the toe. Day two, we're gonna work up the body, so that's everything here in red. Then day three, we will go ahead and do the top cuff here. And like it's kind of worked like that. And then day four, we'll do the heel and then add this little embellishment to the top. Uh, I'm really, really excited to go along and crochet this with you. All of the sections will be free on my website and just day by day, each new section will be added. If you would rather have um, really easy, easy printable instructions, I will have the PDF there as well. Um, and that will just be section by section. You can go ahead and purchase that on Ravelry. Then at the end of the crochet along, all the sections will be free on the website, but they will also um, be bundled together nicely in just a regular crochet pattern if you buy the pattern on Ravelry. I have several other cozy alpine patterns. I have a bobble pattern. I have a poof, kind of where you can um, your kids can sit on it or you can use it as a footrest, and um, a pumpkin pattern. And so I have bundled those up all together at a nice discounted price um, with the crochet along pattern. So you can go ahead and purchase that as well if you really like uh, my alpine patterns that I have worked in the round. Okay, so what we're going to need to get started is two colors of yarn. This one I did in a nice deep red and white. Um, the white is my color A, and you need about 120 yards of your color A. The red I used as color B, and you're going to need about 185 yards of your color B. I will be showing you how to work up your pattern um, day by day using YouTube videos like this one, um, YouTube tutorials, and I'll, I'll actually show you, you my hands working uh, and working up the pattern. My color A will be this lighter color of green, and my color B is going to be this darker color. This yarn that I'm using for this is the Wander Acrylic yarn from Frills Fiber Arts, um, and the, this light color is called Patina. And the darker color is called Meadow. So patina and Meadow are the two colors that I'm using for here, but just use whatever you have on hand and it will be super fun. Uh, you could go red and white. You could do the greens. You could mix and match and do whatever kind of colors that you want. It's worsted weight yarn, number four. Um, this is 100% acrylic, and as is this. The yarn that I used here is Vanna Choice from Lion Brand in just white and cranberry, I think it is. Yes. I just thought it'd be kind of fun to do like a mixture of greens for the one that I'm gonna work up for you. So go ahead and grab your yarn and your hook. Your hook is going to be a size H hook, a five millimeter hook. This is another one from Furls. They gave me this yarn and this hook to use for my Christmas projects. Um, and this is what I had in mind in particular. Um, I also have another, <laughs> I've always come up with ideas. I also have another stocking idea. Um, it's just not gonna happen this year, but I'm excited to use this up for the cozy Alpine stocking. Isn't this a beautiful Odyssey hook in emerald and nickel? I love this green. When this came out, I just knew I had to have it. And I love it. I just love the colors. It's like this sparkly green. 
Okay, so go ahead and gather your yarn and your hook and meet me back here on Friday as we start the crochet along. Before you go though, please subscribe to this YouTube channel so that you're notified when the next tutorial comes out and you get notified for all my yarn related content. Go ahead and like this video and comment if you're participating or not. Love to hear from you and I'm excited to start this crochet along with you.